Hey, welcome to Lab Games. I'm Anthony. And I'm Francis. And today we're going to play Brass, Brass Birmingham. Birmingham. <laughs> Birmingham. That was like, was that your best Southern draw? That was not my best. <laughs> All right, Brass Birmingham is an um, hand management kind of economic route building game for Agreed. two or four players. Uh, designed by uh, Gavin Brown, Matt Tolman, and Martin Wallace, mm -hmm. and published by Roxley Games. Right. Plays in about one to two hours. Okay. And we will try to keep it at that. Alrighty, so join us at the table and we'll show you how it plays. Alright, welcome back. Here welcome we, to Birmingham. Brass Birmingham. We have it set up for two players. Um, there's quite a bit to go over here, um, so we're not going to do any of that. We're just going to give you a brief <laughs> overview of what the board really is, what it represents, um, a couple little things we had to do for the two-player setup, yep. and then we're going to jump right into the playthrough. So, if you take a look at the table, you'll see the beautiful countryside of Birmingham. During the day. During the day. So this board, the player board, or the game board, is actually two-sided. So there's a day side and a night side. They mean the same thing, it's just that they look different. Mm -hmm. This um, side shows up better. Okay. Shows up better. It's and a little it, that also goes for the player boards. Um, we'll start with the game board, then we'll jump to the player boards, and then we'll jump to the cards real quick, and then we'll we'll go right into it. So this is really um, the area that we'll be playing for the most part. All mm -hmm. of our actions and all of our um, industrial tiles are going to be built out into these little cities, right? Uh, for the two-player game, all of the the deck of cards that will allow us to build into certain cities has been pulled from the deck. So all of these blue and these sort of like turquoise. They're like green. Cities. They're, those cards locations are not in the deck, mm -hmm. and but you can still build there uh, through other means. Um, on the board, you're going to see a number of resources out. So there's coal in this game, there's iron in this game, and there's beer. 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 So those are consumed when building a uh, an industry tile onto the board, depending on the cost, and we'll go over that in a bit. Um, over here you'll see there are two different wild cards. In this game there are two different cards, but I'll go over them in a sec. Um, we'll jump to the player boards. So on each player board they're identical and we have a number of industrial tiles. Mm -hmm. And they're broken into different categories and different levels within each category. So you have um, breweries, you have uh, manufactured goods, you have cotton mills, you have... I call uh, them pottery barns. Pottery bars, but they're <laughs> potteries, I guess. <laughs> And you have uh, ironworks and coal mines, uh, and they go from levels one through up to eight, depending on which which building you're looking at. Uh, to the left of each tile, there is a cost uh, in pounds and in consumption of a raw material, whether it be iron or coal or beer. Beer. Right. Yes. So. Uh, you'll understand that as we go along. We also have a supply of link tiles, which are for the first phase of the game, but the first era will be these little tugboats mm -hmm. that will go in the canals during the canal era, and they will flip over to become trains when we go into the rail era. So we'll explain that a bit as well. We also start with 17 pounds from the bank yep. and eight cards. So we'll go over the player cards real quick. There are two different types of cards in this game. There are location cards and there are industry cards. Uh, location cards allow you to build any one of your industry tiles into that specific location. Um, industry tiles will allow you to build that specific industry on a matching symbol at a location that is connected to your network. Right. And we'll explain that in a bit as well. The main rule you need to understand is as long as you can pay the cost, uh, pay the consumption cost, and have a link to that location, you can build that particular tile but it has to go from lowest value right to highest so yes. if you think about it think of it as a technology mm -hmm. level so yeah. it starts at level one and it goes up to level two and so forth so we'll be taking turns playing two actions per turn mm -hmm. and then drawing up to our max hand of eight when that deck runs out the error is over and right. actually when the deck runs out and our hand is depleted the error is over mm -hmm. uh, and then we'll move on to the rail error uh, so we'll be doing a lot of actions. Yes. Uh, do you want to go over the actions now, or do you want to do it while we play? Um, we can do them. I'll, I'll go over them really quick. Okay. 
and then we can jump into it. Sounds so good. there are six actions in this game. Uh, the build action is what we talked about. It allows you to build one of these industry industrial tiles onto the board. There is a network action, which allows you to build one of your link tiles onto the board. Mm -hmm. uh, again, there's going to be a lot of rules that apply, and we'll, we'll go over them as we do them. Uh, there's a develop action, which think of it as like, um, like a technological research action that allows you to call up to two of the lowest level tiles from the board as long as it's allowable. There's certain tiles on here that don't allow you to do that. Um, there's a sell action, which allows you to flip a tile, and we'll explain that in a bit. Uh, there's a loan action where you can actually take a loan of 30 pounds, but you'll be reduced three levels of income, and we'll explain that as well. And the final action is the scouting action, which allows you to discard two cards from your hand in exchange for one of each of these wild cards from the board. And you'll see the benefit of that yes. as well. There's so <laughs> many things going on there's here. There's a lot going on. Um, so I have chosen this. That grumpy ball. The most, <laughs> the perfect representative of myself, this grumpy old man, uh, as my player. So I'll be this like lavender color. Yes, and I'm this woman with a little curl on. Yeah, she's very refined. Head. So you'll she be is, the. Yeah. I guess it's like a gold color. Ah, uh, yeah, she's like yellow, yeah. gold. And this is a uh, this is the player track, so it, it's a turn order. So you actually get to go first. Mm -hmm. Um, and again, we're going to go over all the rules. There's a lot of rules in this game. Um, they're little rules, but mm -hmm. they're very powerful rules, and you'll understand. That. They're very restrictive. Yes. Yeah, so we'll go over how that works. Okay, so um, in the two-player game, again, we had to call some cards. So, And the cards all have symbols on them, so you know what they are. Uh, we also had to call some of these um, these market tiles that we randomly placed out each of the markets. So there's just to note, this is important in the game. So there's Shrewsbury, there's Gloucester, and there's Oxford. Those are the three main markets in this game that we're going to be able to sell goods to if the demand is there, right. as well as buy coal. And that's important. Mm -hmm. uh, and you'll understand that later as well. We start with zero victory points on the track, as yep. we should. And we start at an income level of zero, which will hopefully uh, move that along. You also put one beer barrel on every market where there is a demand for goods. So we're going to start with three barrels of beer. All right. That's it. So uh, we have a discard pile. And the very first, uh, in, in during setup, you put out one card from the deck face down because you're only going to get one action in the first round of turns. Um, where every action, every turn thereafter, we're going to get two actions each. And that's to keep the deck Right, because again, the deck is the timer here. So I think that's enough of a long-winded explanation. Yes. I tried to be brief, but <laughs> I think we want to get to the playing. So you are player one and mm -hmm. you could start us off. All right. Okay. So I get to go first. So we actually only take one action first round. That is correct. Which is kind of good, I guess. It's good, <laughs> but yet it's also restrictive. it's limiting. And it's important because in the first round of the game, um, we do not have any influence anywhere, mm -hmm. so our network can kind of start wherever we want to, and that's kind of the point of the first move of the game. That is. It's going to be a little bit strategic, but uh, but not too strategic, because that'll take forever. <laughs> <laughs> You'll sit here for a while. Yeah, you um, could easily get lost in all yeah. the actions you can take in this game. Yeah. All right, so for my first action, we'll see how this goes, I'm going to use this coal building card mm -hmm. so this is just an industry card i can build coal i'm going to put that in my discard up here and i'm going to build a coal mine mm. right here in wolverhampton right. <clears throat> right there right so because it is because francis has no networks on mm -hmm. the board, she yep. can put it anywhere. It's the only time you can really do yep, that. Exactly. So that costs um, five dollars, and that on the side of your player board, on the side of the tile where you where you removed it, it'll tell you how much that's actually going to cost. Mm -hmm. In my case, it cost me five bucks. Well, five pounds. Five pounds. They still call them five bucks. Pound sterling. Yeah. Well, continental currency, probably. <laughs> I don't know. Five currencies. Um, all right, so that'll be five dollars now this is going to generate two coal right away and that's indicated right on the tile so mm -hmm. if it generates either coal or iron it'll tell you on the tile but what happens when you generate is you have to check the market and if there's any spaces empty in the market the market will actually buy what you're producing yes. right away so in this case there's one coal spot open so that's going to go to the market and they're going to pay me one dollar which is the going price for coal right now and now the market's full so yep. any additional coal will stay on the tile correct 
and that's it. And that was your one action. Yep. So one thing to keep note of is every action you take, regardless of what you do, you have to discard a card. Right. And it doesn't matter what card, but there has to be a card. This is part of the timer, and that indicates your action. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to discard a card. So I'm going to discard one of these um, brewery cards. And again, it doesn't really matter depending on the action you're taking. And I'm going to build a route mm -hmm. or a link. And I'm going to link because I don't have any networks on the board. Normally, you have to build a link off of a network, but I don't have any, so I can establish one right now. And I'm going to establish one here in Gloucester. Very good. And that link in the canal era has to be a boat, has to be on a track that has water, mm -hmm. which this one does, and it's going to cost me three pounds. So I will go and change out for five and pay three to my dude. Very good. All right. And that is it for our action. So yes. once you, uh, did you draw up your card? Oh, I did not. All right. So at the end of your actions, you always draw back up to your hand limit. So now that I'm down to seven, I draw one, but every turn thereafter, we're going to be drawing yes. two. Uh, and now we determine turn order. And how right. does that work? Yeah, so the, the player who spent the least amount of money becomes the first player. Yes. So because you only spent three dollars and I spent five, you actually become first. Correct. And we put our money off to the side because we like to see these people's lovely faces. I want to see how angry he gets because <laughs> he actually gets angrier the longer we play. He does. He really does. <laughs> he gets really cranky. He's so bad. <laughs> Uh, right. So, and then final step is income and we're both at zero, so yep. we don't get any money. Okay. All right. So I'm actually player one, so I get to start us mm -hmm. off. So I think I'm going to go right ahead. Ugh, this is tough. <sighs> Two actions. I don't have the cards I need. Mm. Yeah, I know this is, this could be better. Um, I could, for example, oh, that's Actually, I can't do that either. I really didn't plan well here. Let me... <laughs> you only did one thing. I know, and I, did, and I did it bad. It's like the same thing you always do. I know, it really <laughs> is. Uh, I'm going to go ahead, I just because I have to burn a card, mm -hmm. because I don't really want to do this. So I guess I'll burn one of these ironworks. Um, and I'm going to take out a loan. Mm -hmm. So how the loan works is you discard a card... You take 30 pounds from the bank, 10, 20, 5, and 30. And then I go down three full steps, so three coin values on the income track. Yes. Okay. So now I am at a deficit of 10 pounds per income round. Well, minus three. Oh, three pounds. <laughs> oh, maybe three. Oh, you're looking at your victory points. Yeah, my... my you also have zero victory points. My math is off. Okay, so... <laughs> all right, so that is done. Now I can try to build something else. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I'm going to do an action called... Oh, that's kind of an expensive action. I don't think I want to do that either. Maybe I'll do this instead. I'm going to build a... I'm going to play another Ironworks card. Okay. And I'm actually going to build an ironworks this round, hmm. right? Because I have a network connection to Redditch. Yes. And I will build an ironworks there because it has the matching symbol. Yeah. So I have to pay five pounds mm -hmm. and I have to consume a coal. Right. So you have to have... So here's the thing with coal, right? Yeah. I think I should explain Yes, this. okay. So coal in this game has to be transported. To, yeah, it's very heavy. It's very heavy. And right. it has to be transported to where you're building, right? right. For, for the production of, the, of my iron works. So you have to have a link. And it doesn't have to be just you. It could be anybody's link. Mm -hmm. But there has to be a system to get it there. Um, in the town of Redditch, or the city of Redditch, I have a link that goes to Gloucester. And Gloucester shows you right here that it sells coal. From the yeah, market. From the market. Had I been connected to Wolverhampton, I would have had to consume that coal from that mine. But since I'm not connected, I can't get it here, I can actually buy it from the market. And so I need to, to buy one coal from the market at one pound, because okay. that's the going rate at the market right now, to consume that. If I can't get any coal to the building, mm -hmm. I can't build it. Right. Simple as that. So five pounds and a coal builds me an iron mine. All right. So you get to works. actually put two of your iron on the market. Right. So this normally produces four. So mm -hmm. it comes out with four but two because there's availability in the market and mm -hmm. I earn one pound per, so I'll get two more pounds. Very good. So that is my second action. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep, I draw up to eight and it's your turn. 
Okie doke. Well, that's kind of stinky because I wanted to build an ironworks too. Oh. And I wanted to sell my iron. <laughs> <laughs> Um, oh well that's okay all right so I'm going to I will start by um yeah I think I think I'm thinking if I want to yeah I was thinking if I want to take my loan now, if I'm going to wait, and I think I'm going to wait. So okay. I'm going to spend $3 here mm -hmm. to build one of these jobs down there. Okay. And burn a card so I don't forget. <laughs> and Then I think I will build another one actually. I'm gonna keep my Colbert Dale. Uh, so let's bring this guy. I'm gonna do another one. Can you change me out for five? Thank you. Uh, you gave me six dollars. Did I? I would gladly take it. Oh, <laughs> sorry. Okay. Six bucks. And I will build another so one. So you build two links this I'm round. I'm gonna build two links, yeah. Building a lot of canal infrastructure. Right yeah, now. you really are. Probably focused on building. So those. Wolverhampton is expanding. Yes. All right, so that is the end. Yes. Yeah, so let me draw. Right, so draw up. Okay. Turn order stays the same. same. Yeah, we both spent six. Bucks. We spent six okay. pounds. All right. All right. So this income round, I get nothing, but you pay three dollars. I pay three bucks. So this is the only time you don't pay it to the board; you pay yeah. it to the bank. Three bucks. Yep. All right, and I start us off again. Yes. Oh, man. Okay, I have an idea. Okay. I think I know what I'm going to do. Okay. Maybe. Uh, okay, yeah, no. Mm. Dang it. I'm very confused about what's happening right yeah, now. Yeah, I kind of wanted to do something, but I can't. Oh, I could do it. No. Oh, man. It can be so complicated to just do the simplest of things I want to do. It's very poetic. Yeah. Um, I could do this. I can build in Walsall. Walsall? Walsall? What? I think I want to do that. Like Wassel? Do I want to do that? Wassel? <laughs> like wassailing? Wassailing. Uh, like what no. you do at Christmas time? I'll burn Birmingham. Okay. Pay three pounds. That's not very good to do. No, Birmingham. it's not good to burn Birmingham. And I'm going to build a route right between and connect Redditch to Oxford. Okie doke. Um, I would like to have gone to Birmingham, well, but I can't. Burn your Birmingham. A, well, there's a train. Well, you could go. Well, you just built that, yeah. Yeah, I mean, I could have built something in Birmingham, but the problem is, if I need coal to build it, I can't get coal there. Yeah, you're going to have to build a, a route here and come up and get. I've got to come up and get your coal, but yeah. that's that's okay. What I'll, uncle, what right? I'll do in the meantime is I'm going to get rid of another card. So I'm going to get rid of my second copy of Birmingham. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to do the develop action. Okay. That's going to let me um, remove up to two tiles from my player board at the lowest tier. So I'm going to get rid of one of these beer barrels. And I'm going to get rid of... Maybe I should get rid of both beer barrels. Yeah, I think I'm going to get rid of these two. All right, so for each one you get rid of, you have to consume an iron, mm. right, it, with this action. So I can take it from anywhere, and I'm going to take it from my oil refiner, my iron refinery. Oh, okay. So there's two iron for you. Okay. And now, this is the first time it's happening, but this tile now flips because if the coal the mine, consumed, yeah. the iron refinery, or the brewery, that all start with a resource, gets used up, you actually get to flip that tile. That's the whole premise of scoring these in this mm -hmm. game. Uh, so I actually flip the tile, and now I earn and generate three additional income notches. All right, great. So you get to go back up one, two, three, and you're back at zero. Back at zero. Perfect. Excellent. So that was one, two, three, four, five, six. That was both of my actions. It is your turn. That'd be good. 
Okay, um, for my first action, I will take a loan. Okay. Oh, please. Loan me. There's 10, 25. Oh. Yeah, 25. And 30. All right, cool. Thanks. All right. And I need to put on a card to do that, yeah? Mm hmm. Um, there's so many of these Dudley cards. Dudley. <laughs> Dudley. All right. And for my second action. Hmm. Think about where I want to build my. Hmm. I want to like build this beer plant. Beer. This beer plant. But I would have liked to use. And maybe I'll do my iron first. All right. So we'll do this first. So I will build in Dudley my iron workers mm -hmm. plant whatever let's build that there so that cost me five bucks and a coal which is going to come from my coal place up here my coal mine yeah mm -hmm. so we're going to flip that and that actually sends me up for income four so now i'm making a dollar all right which is fantastic and then that gets four the market's filled Unfortunately, saturated with iron. I flood the market so, with iron. That all goes on here. So that is action number one. Oh, two. action number two. Yeah. yeah, that's right. One, two, three, four, six. Perfect. Yep. Okay. So it looks like you spent the most again. Did I? Wow. You did. <laughs> Big spender. Big spender. Oh, well, building, becoming a captain of industry is not cheap. It is not. It really is. Actually. Isn't. So that is that. Uh, you actually earn one, one. pound income Thank this you. round, and it is my turn. Mm -hmm. Okay, for my first action, I'm going to go to Burton on Trent. So <gasps> I have a city car. No! <laughs> And I'm going to build a brewery. Are you kidding me? No. Are you kidding me? <laughs> That's exactly what I was going to do. Oh, stop it. Look, Burton on Trent. Oh, how many Burton on Trent cards are I've, there? I've never gotten Burton on Trent cards. <laughs> so, and I was going to build a brewery out there. Seven pounds. And I have to consume iron. But I, if there's any iron mills out here or refineries, I have to consume from it. So I did have to consume your iron. Um, in the canal age or era i can only put you come out with just one barrel of beer in the railer or get to so if you could hand me a barrel of beer mm -hmm. all right so i now have a brewery yeah i don't know what else i can't to believe do you built a brewery that's the one brewery. thing i was gonna do well <laughs> it had to be done had to be done all right so i I guess I'm gonna just I'm gonna get rid of this. Oh, that's actually not a bad card either. Ooh, okay. So gosh. I'm gonna get rid of this iron refinery card and I'm gonna build a link to Tamworth. Mm. That's gonna cost me three more pounds. That's my second action. Big spender this round. Hey, big spender. All right. Oh, I don't like these cards I keep picking. Oh, they're actually not bad. Hmm. Well, this changes everything. The Burton on Trent. I hope you know. <laughs> it's such a weird name. I hope you know. Hmm. Did I throw a wrench in your works? In my ironworks. In your ironworks. Yeah. I got all these like weird industry cards. Um yeah, you did. Hmm. The thing is I'm near this town Shrewsbury and I have no city cards that build in any cities that manufacture goods. Mm-hmm. 
You know what I mean? I know you're mean. All I do is I build these cotton mills right now. <laughs> it's ridiculous. You and your cotton mills. It's ridiculous. Um, okay, well I still have Burton on Trent. What do they oh see they want they want manufactured goods. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Yeah. Yes, so I don't That's think we good. covered this rule. In the canal era, mm -hmm. you can only build one of your industrial buildings mm -hmm. in a city. So right. I can no longer build in Burton on Trent, for example. Yes. But other players can. That only applies to the canal era, which is our first era. Mm hmm. Interesting. Hmm. I really wish I had. There's a lot of cards awesome. I wish I had. All right. Okay. So we're gonna we're gonna change things up a bit. <laughs> okay. Mm-hmm. Um. Yeah, we'll see how this goes. All right, so I'm going to spend three and build a link over here to wassel. Wassel. Wasseling. And then I will build, and then I think I will build a brewery Ooh, of my own. <laughs> your very own brewery. A very own brewery. In Walsall. In Wassel. Walsall. Walsall. Right here. Boom. There you go. So that's five bucks. Whoops. And an iron that comes from my iron plant. And that's my second move. That's second your second move. move. So draw gets up. A barrel. Gets beer. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, I didn't discard. You'd see? Yeah, I know, I know. That's you always forget I to know, discard a card. I'm not, not you, but the general you. The general. It's yeah, very easy to forget you. to discard a card when putting out a, a link, but you always have to remember. Mm. So it's good to count your cards okay. before you draw. Okay, so you look like you get player one. I do finally. Finally, right? Do I? Yeah. I've, I've got ten speaks. out there. Yeah. Great. So you're now player one, and do you get income? I do, I get one dollar. One dollar, and I'm still at zero. Uh, but you get to start us off this time, actually. Yes, I, I do. I do. Yeah, wow, that was an expensive brewery. What was an expensive brewery? The one I built because it was a, a level two. Mm. Because I had developed out of my level right, one breweries. Yeah. One thing to note that we didn't also talk about is at, at the end of the canal phase, all of these little boat routes are removed from the board after they're scored. And all of the level one buildings are removed from the board because their technology is outdated. Correct. Yeah. So it gets a little crazy. It does. It like pretty much resets the board if you don't have higher level buildings out mm -hmm. there. All right, I'm going to. I'm going to build this. Wait. <laughs> no? Yes, I am. I can. Okay. I okay. was thinking, can I do that? Burton on Trent. It is. I'm going to build in Burton on Trent. Okay. Um, can't build a brewery, but that's okay because I'm going to build a package. Package. It's manufactured good. Whoops. So that's going to cost me eight. Oh. I'm sorry, what? Where are you getting the coal from? I'm going to buy it from the market. You can't. Oh. <laughs> You're not connected. Ah. Connected. Connected. Um. Oh. Gosh darn it. Gosh darn it. That. Um. All right. So wait. Let me think about how to do this then. Um. Yeah, all my coal's all sucked up, isn't it? Yep. That's why I, it's, I'm kind of locked in as well. I can't really build anything without coal. Oh, uh, yeah, that's right. Um, yeah, I don't have like a Birmingham or anything. It just stinks. Um, 
Okay, so I guess it well this might take me extra turns, but we could do it. We can do it. I will build in Colebrookdale. Hmm. How appropriate. A coal <laughs> factory. <laughs> coal mine. Because I actually have to build something here anyway to connect to Shrewsbury. If you want that link, sure. You know what I mean? Yeah. So I think since there's not that much coal out there, it'll be a good idea. Mm. And it only cost me seven dollars to build this coal thing. The coal thing. The coal thing. And one of those is going to go to the market, so I'm going to make one dollar off of this. Okay. Here's your dollar. Thank you. The market is now tapped full. Okay. So that was my first mm -hmm. move. Um, still can't build in Burton on Trent right now. Not without a link, yeah. Man, this is like a river going through. It here. is, I know. It's like this funky canal, which isn't bad. It's a canal waiting to be made. It is. It's a canal waiting to happen. Yeah. I actually almost built there. Did you really? At one Why point. Why didn't you? Yeah, because I want to go to Tamworth. Uh, I kind of want to go to Tamworth too. Do you have like all the same cards that I do? No, unfortunately. Are you sure? I feel like you might. Um, yeah, this is kind of like. Yeah, that's a rail only, so that's you know like I mean? out of play. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot. Like, I can't get to Birmingham this this era directly from Redditch. All stinks. right, there's a lot of things I want to do, but I think I'll start by. I'll just pay another three, and I'll build another one of these guys. Oh, so you're going to build there. All yep. Right. Why not? And a card. I wanted to make sure I paid you. I don't know why I built here. <laughs> this little like No, because I've been thing I've been keeping away from Reddit lately. Reddit. <laughs> <laughs> it's a red ditch. It's a red ditch. Um alright, I need to burn a card. I'm trying to figure out which one I want to build or which one I wanna get rid of. This one. I might use this one I may not. Yeah, I have terrible okay. cards, by the way. Uh, me too. Your turn. All right. I am going to start by doing the scout action, which we've not done yet. Mm. So with the scout action, I will get rid of two cards. Mm -hmm. Plus one. one. Plus one. We'll plus one for the action. So I'll do one for the action, and then two more. Mmm, yeah. No, these two. Two more. So I've basically discarded three cards, but I'm going to get two back. So my whole action was just to get one of each wild card. Mm. And then my second action, I'm actually going to go right out and spend a wild card. Uh, it's the wild manufacturer or industrial card, which allows okay. me to build anything okay. that's linked to one of my networks. So I'm going to build in Tamworth, mm -hmm. and I'm going to build a coal mine. Okay. And that's going to cost me five bucks. Okay. Five pounds. It's going to get two pieces of coal, and because the market is so full of coal right now. <laughs> and that's my second action. All so, right. Cool. So you are going to be player one. Yeah. Did you take your two cards? I did not. One, okay. two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. All I'm right. just going to take this dollar as my income. All right. I will put these in the bank. Okay. I still have zero income. And it's your turn again. It's my turn. I had more plans. <laughs> okay. I did. Well, you can execute now. Uh, okay. So I'm going to play a card. It just happens to be a town I don't need, and I'm going to build a route. And I think I'm going to take it down to Birmingham. Mm. I think. Man, this my routes are so bad. But I'm going to have to do it. So it's going to cost me three bucks. Okay. Three pounds. And then I'm going to build something else. Maybe I'll build something in Birmingham. So in Birmingham, I'm going to build for eight pounds. There's my Birmingham card. I'm going to build for eight pounds a manufacturer right there. Okay. That's going to cost me eight. So here's five, 
six, seven, eight, and I'll take two out of the bank for ten. Okay. And that is now a manufacturing plant and one coal. And I have coal right here that is mm -hmm. connected, so I can burn that. Connected. Connected. One, two, three, four, five, six, and that's it. One, two. All right, you done? Mm hmm That mm. was the end of my action. I see. I see. All right, I'm going to build in Burton-on-Trent. Burton-on-Trent. For this package, now that I can get there. All right. Yeah? Mm-hmm. Um, that cost me $8. Five, six, seven, eight. And a coal that I can get from here. Chugga, 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 chugga. Right? I see. Chugga, chugga. Well, it's not really chugga, chugga. Right? <laughs> <laughs> it's, <not> like... <laughs> it's like you're rowing it down the river. <laughs> battle boat. No trains. No trains no yet. Trains. All right. So that is built. Um, crap. What did you just build? Oh, the manufacturer. I built that thing. Mm. Um, <gasps> Why is that a problem? It's a problem because I wanted to get that beer beer can. And you're not connected. And I'm not connected, oh. but you just built that because you're going to be connected. And you're going to use that instead of using your own. I don't necessarily have to do that. Yeah, but you will. Why wouldn't I just sell it here? Because you're not connected to here. One route. Yeah, I know. You say that. I don't but... need that beer, technically. I have my own beer. I know, but this beer gives you extra points. It does, and this beer lets me move something. They're both good. Don't worry about what I'm doing. No, I always worry about what you're doing. I need to set up some good combos here. Stop doing that. You're making me nervous. <laughs> um, yeah, because that's really the only reason I did that. I know you like to set up these massive. So here's the thing. It's not about setting up massive combos. It's about is it even worth taking the move to set if, me up? If I'm just setting you up. Right. Yeah. You know what I mean? I agree. Like you'd rather do it on your next turn and then do your sell. Right. So you capitalize. Exactly. Yeah, I agree. So you know what there's I mean? other things you can do, I'm sure. Because that cost me eight bucks, too. Mm hmm. Then you're down to $10. But mm. I'm going to go next. Yes. So. If you don't spend any more money. If I don't spend any more money. How much did you spend? Ten bucks. Ten dollars? Uh, Eleven. I have 11 out there. You to your eight. So you have to spend it. If you spend at least four dollars, then we stay. Really? Mm hmm Um... Okay, I am going to, for my second action, mm -hmm. I'm going to take a loan. You take another loan? Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, yeah, and I'm thinking about what card I want to get rid of here. Like... Please, this one. Oh, maybe this one. Okay. All right, here's. All right, so that's going to take me down. Three, one, four. two, three. All Which right. is still only, it only takes me down to negative two. Yeah, it's not a bad time to take money out. Right, Build your empire. So, so that's your end of your turn. Done. Draw up. Draw up. Should be the last two cards. Yep, last two. Oh, okay. All right, so that is um, it. So I'm first player. <clears throat> I'm going to pay two dollars. You get zero dollars, and we begin again. Yeah, you lead us off. Okay. Take us away. Like Calgon. Like Calgon. Okay. 
So my first auction, I'm gonna build a boat for $3. Okay. With which card shall you spend? <laughs> Probably one of these two Wolverhampton cards I just picked up. That'll work. Since I already it's built, already built there. Yeah, that's actually good. Um, then my second action is I will sell my package, my packaged goods. Okay. So to sell a good, as in manufactured goods or pottery or cotton, mm -hmm. Uh, they typically cost one or two beer yes. barrels. So you have to have a connection to a beer barrel that's not yours. Mm -hmm. Or you could take one of your beer barrels from anywhere. Right. There so doesn't need to be a route. I happen to have, I have a beer barrel here, mm -hmm. but I'm going to save that one in my little beer factory or whatever. My brewery. <laughs> your brewery? Your beer factory? <laughs> my beer field. Um, but I'm going to take this one from Shrewsbury because Shrewsbury happens to have a merchant that needs packaged goods. That is true. So I get to take this beer barrel. And the reason why I was so like hell bent on doing that is because you actually get four victory points right away if you take that one. That is correct. So down here. The first blood one, has two, been three, drawn. Four. Yes. Um, and then because I was able to flip my package, that actually puts my income up five steps, which is why I wanted to take that loan before gotcha. I did that. So. Um, but that is it. No more cards to draw, so we work with what's in our hand, and it's your turn. That's your two actions? Yep. Okay. So then I will... Hmm. What am I going to do? That leaves me in a pretty precarious position. Uh, I'm going to take a loan. Okay. So I will get rid of this refinery and take out a loan of 30 pounds. 25 and 5. 30 pounds. Kay. First action. Second action. And that brings you down to the negative 3. Right. So my second action is then going to be... Hmm. That's interesting. I can't do that. I'd love to build something right now, but I don't think I can. <laughs> okay. Uh, yikes. Okay, so I guess I'll build a route. Might as well. So I'll get rid of this Canock card, and I will build another link from Birmingham to Oxford. One, two, three, four, five, six, and that's the end of my turn. All right, so you are actually player one now. No, because that wait, route wait. cost me three pounds to build. Oh, okay. So, so take it back. Cool. Stays. Um, I get two bucks, you pay three bucks. Here's two, and here's my three. And it's my turn. And it's your turn. We're getting down to the nitty gritty on the uh, canal era. This is where all the points need to come in. I know. I know. All right, I'm going to build my first action. Um, change me out five, please. Mm -hmm. Thanks. I'm going to pay three and build this boat right here. It's a giant boat. That is a big boat, <laughs> isn't it? <laughs> a little boat for that huge I river. I know, it's like, it takes a really long time yeah. to get to stone. Stone. Um, Did you play I'll a card? Burn. I'm playing it. I'm, I'm just reminding. It. I know, I know. It is really, oops. Wolverhampton. Wol right. Wolverhampton. Wolverhampton. All right, and then for my second action, I am going to build this another brewery. Oh wow! For five dollars, and I'm building it up here in stone. Mm -hmm. Um, but I need an iron, so I'll take it from here. Okay. I am linked. You don't have to be linked for iron. Yeah, so. irons. Yeah. Not iron's easy to transport. That's why right. you didn't need. They could just take it by car, I guess. I guess, yeah. Do they have cars back then? No, probably. They could use like wagon, horses. horse and buggy. Yeah, horse and buggy. <laughs> by horse and buggy. I don't know what kind of horse? Does <laughs> yeah, this. horse does that. <laughs> a rowing horse. <laughs> well, they're in the boats. Like I picture paddle boats, but I guess that's probably not right. No, there's yeah, I'm sure. This is the late 1700s, so it is, yeah. yeah, it's definitely a river boat. River boats, yeah. yeah. Okay, so where was I? Ah, yes. 
So I'm going okay. to start out by spending a card and selling. So I'm going to sell this manufactured good. So that manufactured good is going to use beer and sell to Gloucester because Gloucester has a need for manufactured goods. So mm -hmm. I'm going to take that beer to consume and I'm going to get to burn one of my tokens at the bottom. So I'm going to get rid of my level one cotton mill mm -hmm. and that's going to get, move me up three, uh, five income. Five income. Yes, oh, okay. please. Um, down here, right? Yep. Okay. All right, so I'm up to a positive wow. net one now. That's mm -hmm. good. That's good. So I need to expand a bit, I think, and prep for next turn. So I'm going to build a road. I will use this Kidderminster card and spend three pounds. And build, not a road, but a... A ferry boat to Nuneaton. To Nuneaton. Yep, that's the end of my turn. All right. All right, so we don't draw up, but we do player switch. order. Yeah. So now we switch because I only spent three pounds that round. Okay. So now I'm player one. Yep. And your income is what? Two. Here's you one. two. I'll take one. Right. And my next action, and I can continue my thought here, <laughs> was to build and i'm going to use my wild location card mm -hmm. to build in new neaton so nice. i can build any thing in new neaton so i will spend twelve dollars this is gonna be a big money round for me mm -hmm. twelve bucks to build a cotton gin is that what it is a cotton mill a cotton mill <laughs> cotton gin all right so that was twelve bucks for that brutal and my second action, I'm going to go ahead and sell it. Okay. And I'm going to sell it to Oxford because Oxford has demand for cotton. Mm -hmm. Right? And I have a link all the way down to Oxford. Mm -hmm. See? Very good. So I'm going to flip this. I'm going to spend the beer from Oxford. Mm -hmm. And that's going to bump me up two rungs on the income track plus an additional five for my cotton mill. Oh, yeah, very good. And that's the end of my turn. Very nice. All right. That was, that was crazy. That was really that tough. That was very good. Okay. I'm going to burn this Worcester card. Uh -huh. The Worcestershire card. The Worcestershire. And place a thing here. A boat. Uh-huh. There. I was kind of like upside down. All right. So I was like up the river. So that was three bucks. Okay, three bucks. And you played a Worcester card. I did. All right. Um, and then I'm going to build. Mm. Ooh, interesting. Very interesting. <laughs> well, I'm just looking at where the routes are because the thing is, when you're trying to get stuff to places, yeah, like I, we can use each other's. You can. Routes, our routes are connected I mean? now, like so we can pull coal from pretty much anywhere now. Right. Yeah. Which is makes for a very interesting thing. Mm -hmm. Um. Okay. So I'll use my Stafford card, I think. How much money did you spend? I spent $12. $12? Mm -hmm. Mm hmm I see. I'm gonna do that. I'm thinking about what other... Oh, right, 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 okay. So that was my first move, right? Mm -hmm. You spent you spent twelve bucks. I spent a whole twelve dollars. <clears throat> okay, so it's not going to matter anyway. I'm going to spend my Stafford card, mm -hmm. 
and I'm going to spend $17. Oh, wow. Sounds like you're building a pottery barn. I'm building a pottery barn. Wow, yeah, he just At went the mad stacks. I did. Um, yeah, in Stafford. And now that is going to cost me also a one of these iron. Iron, yeah. So that's going to spend my last iron. Flip this. It's going to bump my income up three. Okay. And then I built my... And you built your pottery, your pottery barn. Thing. Very good. So that ends... Uh, um, uh, yeah, we'll, yeah, we have three cards left, right? No, you should have two. Did you discard a card for your route that you built? I did. My Worcester card. Yeah, then you have you have one too many cards left. How did that happen? Uh, you must not have discarded a card earlier. Oh. For a route. Okay. Well, I'll just discard another one to keep it even right. then, right? I guess. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. You definitely have to discard a card. Yeah. Okay. Discard my other pottery card. Okay. All right. Because you did two actions this round. I guess. Did yeah, because you have yeah, seventeen plus I did. three. I built the thing and I did that. Yeah, okay. you must not have. That's okay. For now, we'll have to have you put out your card first no! before you take the action. That's Discard your just card. That's very then weird. The... I don't know how that happened. It definitely happened somewhere in there. All right. Well. Uh, it could have been turns ago. Yeah, I have no I don't idea. know. Who knows? We'll figure it out. Okay. Um, I don't think it breaks the game. So okay. I ended up spending the least. Yep. So you stay in that position. Right. And my income is five bucks. Yep. Mine is three. And yours is three. Thank you. All right. So this is the final turn of mm -hmm. this era. And I pretty much know what I'm going to do here. It's the only thing I really can do because I have a can-do attitude. So I'm going to... Oh, is that where I wanted to go? Yes. Okay. So I'm going to spend this Canock card and three pounds mm -hmm. to build a route to Walsall. Mm. And I'm going to spend my Walsall card to build a... I think I want to build an ironworks. I could do either. But I'm not going to be able to. Yeah, I'm going to put that out there. I'm going to build that manufactured goods for 10 pounds. Okay. Right? And I'm going to have to buy iron because it costs iron mm -hmm. from the market. So okay. here's one, two, three, four, five. And I'll spend another dollar and buy one iron okay. to consume. Cool. So that did that. Oh, wait a minute. I didn't want to do that. Bring that back. Uh, okay. Bring that back. There was a reason I did all this. Mm. Where's all the money I spent? <laughs> okay. The $11. 11 pounds. I wanted to build the refinery oh, okay. for $7. There's a reason I did this. Okay. $7. Because I need to spend you coal, to use your coal. Yeah. and I needed to bring my coal to use that yeah. in order to trigger this. So if you grab me four yeah. iron for that, because I wanted to activate this before the end of this era. Okay. And that's four income. Okay. That's it. Okay. All right. I knew I was the reason mm -hmm. why I was doing that. Okay. All right. So for my last move. Ooh, of let's this, see. Of this Make it era. a good one. Um, I feel like there should be, oh yeah, because there's cards there. There's no like, more there should cards. be something on that yes. sign. <laughs> there should be a deck of cards there. <laughs> They're all, they've all been used. All right. Um, so I'm going to spend my Tamworth card. Uh -huh. And I'm going to build this cotton mill. I think Tamworth needs a cotton mill. Uh, okay. You can right? do that. I can do that. Absolutely because can. Because it is a city. Yeah. <laughs> because cities. Because cities. <laughs> That's going to cost me $12. Okay. okay. And then with my last card, I'm going to take a sell action. Mm -hmm. I'm going to sell a bunch of stuff. So I'm going to sell my pottery. Okay. Um, which requires a beer. Where are you selling it? I'm going to sell it all the way, oops, all the way down here to Gloucester. Okay. Okay. Um, so that costs a beer. So I'll take that from here, mm -hmm. which flips this. Yes. So that sends my income up four, two, three, four. And then I flip this guy because mm -hmm. he's sold. 
and that flipped that makes my income go up five five more five and then i can repeat the process as many times as i want to right for other things as long as there's beer as long as there's beer and we got plenty of it mm -hmm. so i'm going to sell my cotton mm -hmm. along the same route because gloucester also needs cotton because cotton because cotton mill and so that beer I will spend from here, which is my beer, right? Correct. And flip that beer. And you could have technically sold, took my I beer. I could have taken your beer. Because there's a route. Because there's a route to it. Um, but in this case, and I'll explain why I did that, I guess. Well, I guess it didn't really. The thing is with flipping mine right now, it's going to send my income up. I get to score for it. Of course. Yeah, you know yeah, what I mean? yeah. And this link of two is going to count for both of these. Uh, and that tile you know is mean? going to go away after this era. Exactly. So it's like, why not? No, I would so. absolutely do that. Yeah. Um, okay. So that goes up four for my income. Mm -hmm. And then that flips my cotton, which sends my income up five. Yeah. A lot of income. Yeah. All right. That's it. All right. So uh, I stay in the lead. Mm-hmm here yeah. so that's fine you get 10 11 12, 12 dollars of income to my so i get all my money back seven, pretty spent, much basically got your full investment back your return on <laughs> my <equity>. roi <laughs> and we are at the end of the canal era right yeah so now we score yes and the way scoring works in this uh, era is pretty interesting because we're going to first score our links and then right. you remove them from the board once you score them so let's Okay. Start going down the chain. So start with that link. Okay. So we'll start with this one here. Mm -hmm. So that is worth, oh, I didn't spend my extra coal. Mm. Darn it. So what we're that looking stinks. for are these link symbols. Yeah. yeah. So, and the thing is when you flip these, mm -hmm. you end up with more of those links. So Correct. I didn't get any for this one, but I did get two here. Correct. So this one's worth two points. Mm -hmm. So so I'll take that off and go up two points. All right. This one, again, worth nothing here, but it's worth two points for this one. Right. Um, this one is worth two plus one is three. Mm -hmm. uh, this guy here is worth four. So right. two for each of these. Uh, another four for this guy. One, two, three, four. Okay. Two, four for this guy. And three okay. for this guy. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. All right. So you are all scored on links. I'll score my links. Okay. So one, two, three for him. Okay. One, two, three for him. One, two, three, four for him. One, two, three, four, five for him. One, two. Yeah, and it is important to note that we get, you actually get to score even if they're Every my symbol. links. Yep. So. Because I built a link between the two cities yep. that have all this manufacturing. Exactly. One, two, three, four links for him. One, two, three, four, five links for him. Wow. And one, two, three, four links for him. Okay. Cool. That's good. All right. All right. So that, so all of our canals are now gone. Yes. Because we've, we've moved out of that era. Now we score any flipped industry tiles. Right. So what do you okay. have? 10, so 14. 14. What do you just want to count them? Yeah. 14, 15, 17, 18, 19, 20, 20, 22. 26, 27, 30. 30. So you have 30 points. So 26, 56. 56. Right so there. Yeah. All right, big jump. Yeah. All right, and then I count mine. So I've got 1, 6, 9, 12. 1, 2, that's 40. Wow, all right. I didn't really do any big buildings, did I? Yeah, why didn't you do any buildings? Because uh, they're coming. Oh, okay. They're coming soon. All right, so now <laughs> we remove any level one buildings from the board. Right. So level one's gone. And they get removed from the gone. game. From the game. So they don't go back to your board. Even if they are use producing ones, stuff. Right? Uh, yes, that's a two. Anything level yeah. one is gone. That's why this is fine. That's a coal because it's level two. So it's level two. Stay. Yep. Uh, this one as well comes off. Yep. So we are back to... Not being very developed. These technologies are obsolete. They are obsolete. That's why they're coming off. Yep. Because nobody wants them anymore. 
And now I'm going to just reshuffle the decks together. Oops, what were you at? 55? 56. 56. Shuffle these decks together and we'll be back to continue into the rail era. The rail era. All right. One last thing we need to do is refill yes. the beer in the markets. More beer. More beer because we drank all the beer. We did. All the beer. All right. Oops. So I start us off. Yeah, go ahead. Okay. I will start by playing a... Wait. What? Oh, we did get our income. Okay. We did, at the very end of the last... All right, just want to make sure. I will start by playing a... Now we're going to get two actions. This is not like the beginning of the game where we each got one. To start, mm -hmm. we get two for this error. So I'm going to play a Coventry card, and I'm going to build in Coventry. And I'm going to build, for seven pounds, mm -hmm. a coal mine. Because okay. we are in the age of coal. Mm -hmm. So I need three coals, please. Okay. It's our first action. Oh, this is expensive. It's very expensive. I may have to take out a loan <laughs> to get this built, this business booming. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay. This is a problem. Yeah. Oh man. Yeah. I, I may. I may actually. You should probably do that before you end up like where I'm at. Yeah, I think I might do that. So I'm going to go ahead. Because again, remember when you take a loan out and you're like up here, like where I am, mm -hmm. you're not going down incrementally one two three steps you're going down dollars well, I know. pounds i guess i'll burn the stafford and i'll okay. take out a stafford loan <laughs> those aren't very good <laughs> no they're not the rates are terrible so 10 25 and 30 pounds and knock me down okay. three notches one, two three yeah and that... you do go on the highest though yeah you do that is that, you're on, so. that is true uh, I will draw up two cards because now there are cards to draw, and you may go. This stinks so. Yeah, bad. it's expensive. It's terrible. So terrible. It like puts the brakes on everything. Now keep in mind we are in the rail era, so to build tracks now it's going to cost five pounds plus coal mm -hmm. that you have to transport there. Yeah. So you have got to do that. But you can also build, you can double and build two tracks for 15 pounds, two coal, and a beer. <laughs> and a beer. Yes, they need beer for that long day. And there's no limit to how many buildings you can put on any one town. Yes, we're going to illustrate that right now. Yeah, so. I'm sure you are. I'm going to build a new Nuneaton. A Nuneaton. Nuneaton. I'm also going to build a coal mine. A Nuneaton. A Nuneaton, right there. Okay. For $7. Four pounds. Dollars Four pounds. and pounds. Oh, crap. Wait a minute. Uh, you want to borrow some cash from the bank? You think? <laughs> I do. <laughs> oh, God. This thing's so bad. You need a small business loan, I think. It's like I should take it now. It's only going to get worse from here, so. Um, yeah. You know what I mean? Oh, I know. I just did it. Oh my gosh, this is terrible. So what is that? Seven, I guess we, we need the coal though, right? Mm -hmm. So, all right, so seven well, bucks. Did I pay, what? Yes, we need the coal. We need it, right? Oh, you could take from my coal mine, that's fine. Well, no, like I need my own personal supply. Well, there's a market. It's all good. Why do you always talk me out of these things? Because <laughs> I'd rather use my coal. Well, Michael. Michael. Who's <laughs> Michael? I don't know. Um, well, the thing is, I'm not connected. If I want to build out anywhere, like, I'm not connected. Like, I'm connected to coal up here. I yeah. have my own coal, actually, over here. True. Um, but. You want to spread it what out? I wanna, yeah, exactly. Like I, the, see, the thing is, like, down here, everything's kind of happening. That's where the market's happening. Like, that's where it's the market's It's all around at. Birmingham. You know what I mean? Which is, I guess, why they. I guess that's why this, they called this game Birmingham, right? Because right? you almost There's are forced like to build around stuff's it. Stuff's happening down there, and these cards you gave me are just like absolutely terrible. Well, it was just luck at the draw, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, because that's gonna be seven bucks as well. Uh All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna take this back. You take that back. You take that back, and I'm actually gonna do something else. I'm gonna build a brewery, actually. A brewery. Okay. Instead. And where? Also in Newington. 
Uh, oh, I can't. You can cannot I? do that. Because I'm not there. That's you, why I wanted to do it this yeah, way. Yeah, 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 yeah. But yeah. you can't afford both. No. Oh, that's rough. Oh, I can't afford both. All right, I'll just, I'll do, okay, back it up, back it up. I'll just do my normal thing. You don't say anything. I don't need your comments. What? No, no. I'm just what I want to do. <laughs> that's fine. You do. Uh, all right. So that'll be $7. Um, can you change me out? I can. 10? It's not ideal, you know. Yep. But it's kind of what has to happen here. So there's my. S Wait. They give too many. No. no, he didn't. That's fine. Yeah, I just can't do math right now. All right. Um, so we'll do that. Okay. And for my second action. We need some rails. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. For my second action. Yeah, we do need some rails. Mm -hmm. You could build your brewery, right? It's only seven bucks. Oh, but you have to buy iron. No, you don't no, have I to don't. buy iron. It's out there. You yeah, can take it from no, me. No, I still could do that. Yeah. Why, why did you, I think I... I don't know. It's only seven dollars. Seven I pounds. I couldn't do that. That's weird. All right. Um, yeah, I don't know why I was thinking it was more expensive. All right, so I'll just do that then. So mm -hmm. I'm going to build a brewery as well. All right. For another seven pounds. For another seven dollars and all my money. Yeah, that's it. You are broke. Three, four, six, seven. No, there don't you Don't pay me. Oh, yeah. Pay the bank. Pay the... Pay the turn order. Tithe here. Now, because we're in the second era, though, that actually gets two beer barrels on yeah, it. That's right. I can't wait to use all of that beer up. <laughs> don't use my beer. Um, all right, so the town of New Neaton is bumping... Um, but and you do I have to consume. Iron, that so. would be one of my iron. But that's cool. Oh, wait, really? You have to. I have to because I don't have an option. Yep. Oh, that's right. Okay. Have to take it from the mines. Aye, aye, aye. From mine first. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> from yours. Yep. All right. Player order stays the same because yeah, you spent a spent fortune. All, like all my money. That's and okay. what is your income now? I'm at 12 $12. Here's 12 and I'm at four. Okay. Man, this is just... It's so tight. So difficult. Why are you always so difficult? <laughs> Why are you so difficult? All right, so I'm going to go right ahead. Where am I? Coventry? I'm going to go right ahead in Coventry and build for 17 pounds. Oh, you're going to do the pottery barn? I'm building a pottery oh, barn. Oh, that's what I wanted to An do. An outlet right here. Boom. All right. Uh, and I need to consume an iron. Mm -hmm. So here you go. Remember, iron can be taken from anywhere. So that was my first action. And my second is going to be to get rid of one of these cards here. Maybe we'll get rid of that brewery card. And I'm going to build a rail. Okay. So it's going to cost me five pounds. This is so expensive. And I'm going to build it right here between Coventry and Birmingham. And it also costs me a coal, so I'll use up that coal. Okay. Right there. Very good. I'll draw two, and it's your turn. Man, this is just... This is, like, so... It's put a damper on my expansion plans. Yes. All right. Okay. This is so challenging. It is difficult. Like, yeah. It really um, ramps up. I, oh, I have so many of these iron cards. Um, all right, so the first, my first action is going to be to take a loan. I have no money, so I'll right, knock myself so down one, two, three whole steps. But better now than later, I guess. There is thirty pounds. Thank you. Ooh, oh. Twenty-nine pounds. <laughs> <laughs> All right, um, and then my second action is going to be, I'm going to build two railroad routes. Oh, for 15 pounds? For 15 pounds. Two coal and a beer. Wait a minute, that's actually not a great deal. It's not a good deal at all. That's why. <laughs> I guess if you really want to do it. That's not a great it, deal. Yeah. At all. Um, 
yeah, that really kind of stinks. That's like if you're desperate. I would say. That's a pretty bad deal. You're or if paying... you want to burn beer. Yeah, but wow. That's expensive. To me, that's a bit much. This is terrible. This is so terrible. All right, well, I guess I'll just build one. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just build one. Build one. All right, so I'll build one. One route for five one coal. Five pounds and one so coal. So I paid my five pounds, mm -hmm. which, depending on the on the year, I don't believe is pounds anymore. Okay, I'll go with that. I don't know. I wasn't the researcher. Well, where are you building that route? Right here. Okay. So it is a train now. Chugga chugga. Now it's going to chugga chugga. Yeah. Okay. And then this is going to flip because I spent the last coal on it. It's gonna seven. pump my income up seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I'm back up at twelve. Back to twelve. Very Perfect. good. Perfect. All right. All right. Draw your two. Yes. Well, I mean, you did make spend... sure one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, okay. So you didn't spend <laughs> any cards. Okay. So <laughs> let's back that up. Okay. Your first action um, was a loan, so burn a card. Exactly. And your second action was a train track, so burn another card. <laughs> Oh man. Yeah. I get it. I get it. I get it. All right. All right. We all had a good laugh. <laughs> all right. Okay. So now you can draw two cards. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So let us see. I'm going to go last because I spent about a thousand pounds. Yes. And we are going to get income. So what is yours? You're at 12. At 12. So here's 10, 11, 12. Okay. And I am at what? Four. Four? God. One, two, three, four pounds. Man, I need to I need to up my my income a bit. All right. Okay. Yeah, you wow, you get to go now too with all I that do. money. Yeah, I do. I don't even know what I wanna do. Well you could spend that stacks. I can I'm trying to not have to do a loan again. So the loans are really weird in this game because it's not like a typical loan you have to pay back. I know. You know? It just affects your income. Exactly. Which is, I guess it makes sense. Because you're paying that off every month. Sure, sure. Versus your income. Yeah. Absolutely. I have to look at what city cards I have around here. So I don't have great, like, manufacturing cards. I have Colebrookdale. Make some more beer. Where's my... Ooh. What's that? I just don't like my cards. I don't. I don't like my cards either. Mm-mm. Yeah, this is... Okay, we've got Birmingham. I've got Canuck. Things I don't have any. Maybe I should build, like, an iron thing somewhere in Colebrookdale maybe Colebrookdale Colebrookdale it's like the church farm <laughs> yes. all right I'm gonna build an iron thing because I don't want to keep using your iron I don't mind I know you don't mind oh can I, I can't take my coal from anywhere can I? I have to buy it from the market you do if unless you have a link to it yeah yeah I don't okay that's fine so I'll spend seven Plus one. For the coal. For the coal. There you go. Thank you. And build my thing right here in Colebrookdale. That's going to give me four iron. Okay. So that was your first action? Yep. Oh, yeah. That was my first action, yes. wasn't it? Ugh. 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 And then... And maybe I'll do this. Maybe we'll stay in Colebrookdale. I'm going to capitalize on Colebrookdale, I think. And I'm going to build another brewery here. Wow. For seven more. Okay. And that gives two... Two barrels? Gears. Yes. And consumes one iron and it consumes one of my iron that i just put out if you so choose your iron yes 
I do. I do choose my own. Now you may draw two cards. Yeah, let me make sure I one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. I noticed you always check yours. I do. Because I don't trust myself. <laughs> so I will start by burning a card. So I'm going to get rid of... Hmm. I'm going to get rid of this Burton on the Trent card. And I will do a develop action. So I'm going to get rid of two tiles. So mm -hmm. I'm going to get rid of this cotton mill here. And I'll get rid of this. Should I get rid of this brewery? Oh, maybe I'll get rid of this coal. Mm. Yeah. I think. I don't know if that is a wise choice. Nah, maybe I'll get rid of this manufacturing good. So those are the two. It's going to consume two iron. Okay. And I'm going to flip that and go up three on the income. To six. So that was yeah. my first action. Mm -hmm. And for my second action, I'm gonna oh, I'm gonna build. Wow, that's so expensive. I know. Eek. Alright, I'm gonna build in Birmingham. Birmingham card and build a cotton mill right there for $14. What? 14 pounds. Maybe I'll just hit this stack. One, two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. Fourteen pounds. Wow. Ah, what? A... Really? Yes. <laughs> all all and singles. It's going to consume <laughs> one of my coal, and that's it. One, two, three, four, five, six. I draw two. Give me something good, please. That's not good. And that's the end of my turn. So let us look. You have. 15 to my 14. Yes. Yes. So I go to player one. Very good. Well played. Well sir. played. How many? You get what? 12? 12. There's 12. And I get six. Two, four, six pounds. The rest goes back. All right. So we are ready for the next turn. I lead us off, right? You lead us off. Yeah. Oh, my. So I think I need, I think I need to build some routes. So let's build a train, shall we? Okay. What say you? I say build. All right, I'm gonna play a Coventry card and I'm going to pay five pounds. To the And man. a coal to build a train. Okay. Here, right, use that coal. Oh, right. And that's going to flip this and give me another seven income. Wow, okay. All okay. right, that was a big one. That's great. And now I'm going to sell. Hmm, you're get, so excited. Let me get rid of a card here. Let's get rid of... Let's get rid of... Wolverhampton. Okay. And we'll do the sell action. So I'm going to sell... Cotton mm. to Oxford. Okay. Right, because I can't get to Gloucester. Right. Unfortunately. So we'll sell that, consume that beer. I think it only takes one, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, one beer. There you go. Okay. I'm going to go up two plus four, six more notches on the income. Nice. Well All done. Right. That's my turn. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, and I draw two. Very good. All Very right. Good. Cool. 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 Yes. Um. Hmm. What a paradox this is. Paradox. 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 <laughs> <laughs> What's the matter with you? You built this pottery barn. I have this. Free pottery barn I wanted to build. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> that's okay. Uh, what? Yeah, that's terrible. <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> it's not great. So now I'm going to have to do some different stuff instead. I 
wish I had this other card and I don't. <sighs> like Worcester only, my problem right here, so that everyone understands, is that Worcester needs these cotton mills. Mm -hmm. And I would be happy to sell those cotton mills, but I can't build them. Because right. I have these two. They are canal so era like, technology. I was trying to get out of doing a scout action. You or develop? not a scout, the develop action. Mm -hmm. By going here and using that barrel, oh. because it would give me a free one. It give you one. Yeah, but, but you that's need okay. that to do that. Yes, I do. Um, but that's okay. So I think, I think for my first action, I will. I'm gonna build in Wolverhampton. This Wolverhampton. box is these manufactured goods. Right, yeah. Mm -hmm. For ten dollars. I'll use my ten, my big ten. And an iron, which will come from here. So I built that. Okay. In Wolverhampton. And for my second action. What? There's no link. Oh you direct, I direct, oh, you direct I built, built it in oh, Okay, okay. Don't worry. Don't worry. Okay. I have the contract. You do have a building contract for Wolverhampton. Um, and then I guess, I guess I'll go ahead and take that develop action. Mm -hmm. So I'll spend a card. Which one do I want to spend here? Um, it's so hard to decide like where you're going to go. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Where's Worcester? Oh, Worcester's down there. I probably need that. All right, we'll get rid of this. Um, Burton on Trent, I guess. And I will get rid of two industry tiles on my board, and that'll be these two cotton mills, because they're clogging up my industry. These obsolete technologies in my warehouses, in like the front of so all you my finally did technical it? stuff. What do you mean? What'd you just do? I did this. You did the develop action? Yeah, I removed these. Okay, so it burns that. two iron. It burns two or one? One iron per tile. Oh, so did I already burn one? How many tiles did you just burn? Two. All right, then you burn two now. Yeah, but I think I already threw one in there. Oh, you did? Yeah. Oh, okay. I think I'm only down to one. Okay, so are you I down think... to six cards? I don't know. This is too much to keep track of. I know. <laughs> <laughs> too much bookkeeping. Somebody needs to pay attention to what I'm doing. All right, All right, so you stay in second place. Yep. And we both get twelve bucks. We get twelve dollars. Oh, here's twelve for you. Thank you. And I'll take five, five, oh. two. All right, so I start us off. I don't know what I want to do. Hmm. But I think. Hmm. That's not. Great. Uh, hmm. All right. I might. I might do this then. I guess I'm going to play. Oh, that one might be pretty interesting. Okay, I'll get rid of that card. I want to spend five pounds and build a railway mm -hmm. to Redditch, mm. but I'm going to have to take by, because cool. I'm not connected like to this. Newington, so I can't take it from you. Right. So I have to buy it from Oxford for a pound, mm -hmm. which is fine. Okay. And my second action will be to build a coal mine. Very good. In Redditch. Okay. So I will play a coal mine. I am connected to Redditch, and I will pay seven pounds for this. And I'm going to get three coals. Cool. Two of those are going to go to the market. Correct. So I'm going to earn two more pounds for selling back to the market. And that's it. All right. Okay. You're done? Yep. Hmm. 
Hmm. All right, so. And this is like expensive, but at the same time, you are getting money. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Yeah. And you have a lot of money going on. I do. I have a lot of money. Because um, what I'm thinking I want to do, I'm just deciding whether it's worth like expediting this and it's really probably not you know mm. what i mean so i think i'll take it i'll take it slow here just um i'm going to spend A card. I kind of wish I had like more stuff out there though. Oh, do I have a Canuck? I do. Hmm. I want to build like a train here. But I'm trying to think if I can get like more stuff. If I do a sell action and I sell, I want to sell like lots of stuff at the same time. I like right. when I sell lots of stuff at the same to time. To trick it all? But it's not, it doesn't always work out that way. No. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like Shrewsbury is kind of just manufactured goods. Like it's not really great. Like that's where this is like all happening is down here. Yeah, Birmingham is the happening right now. It really is. I just have nothing really like happening down there. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. All right. So I will. Yeah. Like the the downside to doing this just one at a time is that you can really get a lot of routes out if you do them like doubled like that. It's so expensive. But it it is it's so expensive, and you need coal. Mm -hmm. and I have none. I have none coal right now. Except for from here. Yeah, you could buy it. It's cheap right now. It is super cheap. All right, so I'm. I guess I'll just do this for now. Get rid of this Dudley card, and I'll build for three dollars. Oh, five dollars. <laughs> I was like, whoa! What are you building for three dollars? <laughs> Nothing. Nothing anymore. Um, I'll build this train and a coal that I will buy from the market for a dollar. All right, there's your pole. Thank you. That's action one. Action one. Um, and then I guess I'll go ahead and sell for my second action. Here. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll sell this package mm -hmm. to Shrewsbury. So, flip that. Oh, it only increases my income by one? Yes. Ah, I may not do that. <laughs> I may take that back. Yeah, it's a pretty bad one. That's a really not a great one. I would rather spend my time doing other stuff. Mm. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's really not worth it, to be honest. Yeah. Like, I'd rather do... See, like I'd rather do, I'm not connected to any coal here though is the problem, you know? Mm -hmm. I need to bring like more trains down. How much money did you spend? $13? Mm -hmm. Ah, I'm so stuck. I'm so stuck. All right, and my second move, I will go to Kidderminster. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to build Kidderminster Coal. 
Okay. Again. <laughs> um, okay, so that will cost me eight dollars. And one, two, three, eight dollars. And the last iron on my thing, right? Yeah. I can spend uh, it from yes, that's true. Right. You can. So that bumps me up three income. Okay. All right. And you need to put coal. Yeah, and four coal. In oh, yeah, I do. You do. I will need that coal. Over here on the on the west side. Yep, and then <laughs> you get one pound in sales. Oh, yeah. Thank you. All right, and All it right. looks like and you we... just outspent me. I did. I know, like by a by dollar. By a pound. Okay. All right, so your income is now thirteen. So yep. here's thirteen pounds. Thank you. My income is twelve. Nice. I will take twelve. And I get to start us off. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right. I kind of forget what I was. Can you give me twenty? Yeah. Wait, hold on. Are five, you saving 10, all your 15, money? Twenty. Yeah. What? You saving all your money for? I have these like nice chips. I want to use them. Okay. Uh, all right. I think I want to go ahead and build a route. Mm, okay. So. I'm going to go and build, maybe I'll get rid of, hmm, yeah, I'll get rid of that card. And I'll pay five pounds. Okay. And build a route right to Gloucester. Hmm. And I'll use my last coal. Oh, okay. -doke. And that's going to give me an income of seven. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right. And that was my first action. Okay. My second will be to sell cotton. Okay. From Birmingham. Nice. So let me ditch a card here. And sell cotton. So flip that. Only, it's only, oh, I can't. It's already been sold. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm going to sell your pottery. My pottery. Okay. I knew I yeah, was selling something. All right. So I'm going to use that gives beer. You five, right? Income. It gives me five income. Sell that beer. It's going to allow me to develop something. So with that develop, I'm going to go and scrap you. You are giving that to me. <laughs> no, I'm just holding it. Okay. I'm I took it. All right. So I'm going to scrap you. Um, I got five income for that, right? Mm hmm. And consume the beer. I think that's all I can do. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep. Yeah. All right. Well, we're getting close to the end of I this know. pile. I know. Yeah. All right. So for my first action, I'm going to spend a card, mm -hmm. and I'm going to do the mega tracks. I'm going to build two routes. Mm. So that's two coal. Well, build your routes because the coal has to come from oh okay. something that well, connects the sure. routes. I'm going to build them. Right here, and right, and I built a boat here. Yeah. I'm so used to building those boats. And right here. Okay, so that'll use those two coal from that place, yep. and fifteen pounds. And fifteen. To the pounds. bank. To the bank. Yep. Okay. Okay, that's, that's, that's your first. first action. Oh, and a beer. Oh, and a beer. Yes. And that's fine. I'll use this beer. Okay. Actually, I can use beer from anywhere, right? Mm-hmm. Uh, I guess it doesn't matter. I can use here. It's fine. All right. Um, right. Okay. Um, and then I'm going to build a cotton factory here in Worcester. Worcestershire. Just Worcester. Worcester. <laughs> um, and that's going to cost $14. All right. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 12, 13. I don't know enough. Sorry, I need you to break that 20 again. <laughs> okay. 5, 10, 15, 3. I don't need any more ones. Or 5. Okay. Thanks. There you go. Um, $14. Right to 5, 10, 14. All right. For Worcester. Mm-hmm. All right. 
That's it. That's all I can do. Excellent. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep, that's the last two, right? That is it. Wow, that's crazy. All right, so you stay in second, uh, and you collect $13? I do. Here is 10, 11, 12, 13. Thank you. And I collect $16. 15, 15, 16. Okay. So, I think I'll start out by playing a... Hmm. Yeah, I'll play a refinery card, and I'm going to spend five pounds. Okay. And I'm going to buy a coal, because I'm not connected to coal. So okay. I'm going to pay a dollar for a coal. You're connected? Oh, yeah, you're connected to Worcester. That, yep. And I'm going to build one train to Worcester. Mmm. And then... That's good. I'm going to build for 14 pounds... cotton mill mm. in Worcester and I have yeah. to pay an additional pound to buy a coal. No, I have to take your coal because it's connected now. Hey! Why? That's good because now... No, it... but I needed that. Oh, sorry. But I have to take it from wherever I'm connected. Actually, I don't need it anymore because you built a route. Yeah, you can buy it from Gloucester. Six income. Uh, I had to pay a card for that, right? Mm -hmm. uh, I Did built you? in Worcester. Yes. I built what I build. You built a cotton mill. Oh, crud. What? I can't do that. Why? Because I don't have Worcester. cotton or Worcester. <laughs> okay. Let's take that back. So and that was your first action was to build that thing? Yeah. I feel like you took a lot of actions. No, I just took two. So this flips Yep. and I get my coal back? And I get the coal that goes no i i spent that coal to build, to build i took this. your coal there yeah. okay 14 right so what's your second move gonna be dang it i wanted to build that that was unfortunate yeah that really was that really kind of threw a wrench in the works here hmm. um yikes okay so i guess i could build something else you could maybe i'll build another route i don't really need to though I could use more coal, though. Hmm. Wow, this is really... That really put a damper on things. <laughs> <laughs> I, I mean, I guess I'll build another route. Um, yeah, I'll do this and throw that card out, spend another five pounds, and build a route to Tamworth. All right. Then I'm going to have to buy coal because I'm not connected. Well, I am connected You're still, connected. so I will take that coal. Oh, yeah, I'll lay around here. Yep. So you will take this? Yep. And you do. You already moved yourself I up, moved myself so up, you're so, good. Yeah. All right, we're square. All right. Are you done? Yeah, I'm done with six All cards. Right. Dang, that was rough. This gets crazy. It gets crazy. Yeah, it stinks when you like want to do something and you can't. Yeah, I know. Yeah. For like a silly reason. That is a very silly reason. Um. Okay. All right. So I think I'll start off by selling. So I'm gonna sell this package mm -hmm. to Shrewsbury, and I'll take this beer. Mm -hmm. That gives me four victory points. Right? Mm -hmm. And flips this that sends my income up a whopping one. Wow. <laughs> That's huge. Um, and then I'm also going to sell my cotton to Gloucester mm -hmm. for another beer. Mm -hmm. Which flips this. We'll do this one first. That sends my income up four. One, two, three, four. And that flips my beer factory to which is five. Okay. Okay. 
Okay. Um, second move. For my second move, I am, for my second move, I am going to, how much did you spend? Six. Eleven. Eleven dollars. Oh, that doesn't really matter. The turn order is like important, but it's like, it's not you know, super it's critical. not like super important, especially when we're so like this, you mm -hmm. know what I mean? Um, all right, Cole Brookdale I can burn because that's pretty much done. I'm going to build two routes Okay. for $15. Mm -hmm. I'm going to buy one coal to build one here. Yeah? Yep. Well, actually, can I build this one first? You can build, build whichever one, one you want here. first, yeah. But if I build one here, I'm going to use this there, coal. And then you build one there and take the other coal. Yeah, because yeah. I'm connected then, because mm -hmm. I've got my train. And so I'll use that one to build another one here. And you have to use And I'm going to use this beer. beer. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Mm -hmm. And and I paid my 15 Okay. And one, two, three, four, five, six, and I burnt my whole Brookdale card. So that's it. Okay. And I take no cards because we have no cards left. Excellent. So Whew. I'm still in first. Yes. And your income is 18. Mm -hmm. 18. My income is 14. 1, 2, 3, 4, and 10. Okay. Give me two fives. Sure. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. I'm like, I give these things to you like in, in the, the weirdest, weirdest way. <laughs> I'm just like, here. <laughs> just take these. Uh, okay. What I'll start out by doing is building a $14. No, not that first. Take that back. I'm going to build a coal mine in Tamworth. Okay. It's going to be eight bucks. There's eight. Okay. For the coal mine. And it's going to get four coals. I'm going to get three plus a dollar from the market. How many? Well, so I get, get four. four. Yeah. So you have to put one on the market. Three on there, one on the market. All right. So that was my first action. My second is going to be to build in Tamworth this for $14. Okay. And that's going to cost me a coal and an iron. So a coal will come from this mine and an iron I'll pay a dollar for. Okay. And that I got to pay 14 for. There's 14. And that's all I can do. That's okay. my two actions. Yep, four cards. So let me just get the change going. Yeah, here. get that. This mad stack. Situated. So one, two, three, four, five. And this is 20. Just so it's easy to track how much I have mm -hmm. spent. 23. All right. All right. Um, so for my first auction, I'm going to build a brewery. Another one. Mm -hmm. here. So this will be nine dollars and five, six, seven, eight, nine, and an iron, which I'll have to pay for. I'll just do ten instead. Okay. Right. So it's gonna go there. Yep. With two beers on it. Two beers. Beers. Whoops. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, so I'll be first. Where did this beer come from? I don't know. You must have had two stuck together. Uh, oh. Because okay. there's two level threes. Got you. Yeah. Um, so that'll be first. And did we take an iron off the market? We did not. You paid for it, right? Yeah. 
for my first action. And then my second. Yeah. My second, I'm going to burn this Stafford card. And I'm going to build two routes again mm -hmm. for 15. And they're going to go here, and then I'll pay my coal so you can see what I'm doing. Okay. So I'm going to put one here. Mm -hmm. And so I'll use this coal yep. for that one. And I'll put one like... here okay and i'll use your coal i guess right yep for that one and then pay my beer from here okay so that flips both of these right so that sends me up seven income mm -hmm. and my beer gets flipped that's five income okay my little town of new neaton that's good is flourishing it is flourishing it's a coal and beer town so you're good for. yeah I'm all good. right so you spent 10 I spent... 25 dollars yes but you spent 23 dollars 23 dollars oh i still spent money <laughs> you sure did okay. but you get 22 dollars in income i do which yeah. is that's really good stacks. that's awesome and i get 16 15 16. all right so we are ready for the next set. We have two turns left. I know. This is coming down to the wire. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna do. Hmm. This is unfortunate. Hmm. Yeah, this is really unfortunate, actually. Ugh. I've got such terrible cards. So I'm going to spend that and five pounds to build uh -huh. a route here. Okay. And mm, is that even worth doing at this point? Probably I not. I don't not think so. Not if you know, unless you can sell that stuff. No, it's not. It's actually not worth it, to be quite honest. Why? Because... Why don't you sell that and use that beer? There's no reason for me to do that just yet. Because that's... A, do I really want... Do I need that route right now? Probably not. So I spent this car, but I'm not going what are you to. Gonna, what else are you going to do? I'm going to show you what okay. I'm going to do. <laughs> I'm actually going to build... Do I have... I can't build there. My place is all taken. Oh, I could overbuild there. Mm, we haven't shown how that works. I, I, you want me to do it? No, unless you're... Are you overbuilding on my stuff? Oh, yeah. Wait, you can do that? No, I can't. I'm sorry. So, <laughs> <laughs> so, I was to, like, wait a minute. I missed something. You can overbuild your, your, your production buildings, stuff. right? Like, But the, the trick is, if you want to overbuild your opponent, there can't be any more of that commodity on the market. Right. So if I wanted to overbuild your ironworks, if we were out of iron in the market, yeah. I could technically overbuild your ironworks. Right. But I can't do it but because we've got plenty yeah. of iron and coal out there, so that's not going to work. Um, what I want to do here is, is very limiting because my cards aren't allowing me, which stinks because I have so many cool moves I could have done had I had better cards, mm -hmm. but I don't. So I think I'm going to have to, yeah, wow, that's so bad. I'm going to have to just do what I was going to do and build the route, you know, build that, the route, use up the coal. It's not that bad. It is not great. Let's see. That's going to be worth six, six but it's just income. One, two, three, four, five, six. We don't collect income at the end of the game. So it's yeah, kind of that's why you have to spend your income as you get it. Yeah. And then I'll sell, I'll play Colebrookdale and sell. And I'll sell cotton, and that cotton is going to come down to Gloucester. Mm -hmm. So sell that. It's going to cost me one brew. Mm -hmm. 
-hmm. here. A brewski. It's going to go up four income. One, two, three, four. Flip that over, which is going to bring up another five income. One, two, three, four, five. That's it. That's all I could do. Okay. Not ideal. I don't have anything else I can sell mm -hmm. on the board. Everything else is flipped. Yeah. Yeah. I see. All right. Um, so my first move, I will go to Birmingham and I will build this package. So that's going to be $10. Over five, ten bucks, mm -hmm. and an iron, which is one extra dollar. Two extra dollars for iron now. Oh, really? Yep. Okay. Um, so, oh, yeah, because it's it's hot on the market. Wow. Yeah, we're interesting. ripping through the iron. Um, and then my second will be to do the exact same thing in Birmingham. I have all these Birmingham cards. I know. It's gonna stop. It stucks. It stucks. Um, and I need to buy coal. We have no coal on the board, right? No, we don't. Okay, but we're like well connected, so. I'm pretty well I connected. I can buy. <laughs> for, um, so it'll be $12 for the building. Well, yep. $12 for the thing. And then $2 for coal. two coal. Yep. Um, and that's going over here. For a total of fourteen dollars, so can you give me six back, please? Yeah, that's right. Thank you. Um, yeah. <laughs> my huge. So those are your stack. two actions. Those are my two. All right, so we retain order. Mm-hmm. You get 22 and I get 21. So here's 10, 22. Mm -hmm. I'll take 10, 21. This is it, final turn. Yes. So I'm gonna do a lot of double tracks. Oh. <laughs> It's all I can do. I've got the worst cards. Okay. Honestly, like I have the worst cards. Yeah. Like there'd be, there's no value. Double tracks. There's no value in me putting these out. Okay. It's so bad. So that's your tracks. Um. So I guess we'll do start with one, and I'm gonna pay fifteen dollars. That stinks, cause your pottery barn. It's was... not connected anywhere, and it's not worth any points. Yeah, but you could have built it here, and, and then, then built two things. One, two. And you would have been all the way connected down to Gloucester. True, but this pottery barn is worth one point. That's true. That's a lot That's of true. money to spend to get one point worth of pottery barns. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's like the outlet. Yeah. The it's pottery barn outlet. The really cheap, bad outlet. <laughs> all right, so I can do two routes. So I'll do I'll do a route here. Uh -huh. There's my first route. So I spent 15. I'm going to have to spend two more on coal because mm -hmm. I need to pay for coal. Okay. Uh, mm. Two coal, so I'll Four spend, more. well, two more dollars I owe. So let me take those back. I'll get change for a five. I'll pay four in coal. Okay. So here's two coal. Okay. So my that's my first route. Mm -hmm. Where'd I put it here? Mm-hmm. And my second route, hmm, where can I build from? So many options here. Really, though? Yeah, I do. I have lots of options. Like off of Wassel? Off of here. Mm -hmm. So those are my two. Make that a train, not a boat. And then my second action is to build two more routes. <laughs> it's the only way I want to score. I know. That's what you need to do. Yep. So here's another 15 plus 6. Okay. For, and You're going to make it very challenging for me to sell to buy routes. Uh, it's getting very expensive, yeah. Put a train there. Mm -hmm. Wait a minute. Yeah? What? Where are you getting all this beer? Oh, there's my two beer. No! It's connected. And there's my next route. Oh, you suck. <laughs> That's all I can do. As long as there's a route to your beer, I can take it. That is cheap. I, that's all I could that's do. That's okay. 
It's okay. It's just cheap. That's all. It is, but it's all I could do. You reminded me that I had to take beer. Well, yeah, because that's how the game's I played. know, totally forgot, but there was beer out there. Beer. Yeah. Right. One, two, three, four, five. Um, all right. So how do we do this then? Hmm. Um... Okay, that's fine. This will still work. So if I want to build an industry card that's called beer, beer, <laughs> I yes. can do it anywhere. You're connected. Anywhere I'm connected Correct. to. Correct. That's right. Which is nowhere. Because uh, you've sucked up all the routes. I believe you can overbuild one of your breweries. Oh, that's true. Because we don't have any on the board, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. It's just, it stinks because I, I won't get points for that overbuilt one. That is correct. You know what I mean? That's kind I, of the trade-off. That is the trade-off, yeah. But if you need the but beer. But if you need it, you can do it. I mean, theoretically... Um... Where am, am I close to anywhere? Am I within like, within a link? Of beer? Of beer anywhere? Where do we have beer? Up here, but I'm not here, so I can't build a link. That's right. You are within two Stone. links. Stone. And here. Yeah. That's the closest. That's not going to get it. Mm-mm. Yeah, because yeah, I can't, I'm not... You can't get a route in there. Yeah, yeah. I blocked it off. Yeah. That's the only way. All right. So I'm, I'm going to have to overbuild then. Mm -hmm. But that's all right because I wasn't planning on building another brewery anyway. So it actually is fine. It works out. So I will build, overbuild for nine. Assuming you're going to build this one. I'm going to build it over that. Yeah, the cheaper one. Yeah. So that goes out. It's going to cost me $9 plus an iron, which is two, 2 right now, so yeah. that'll be 11 total. And we'll put that there with two barrels on it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Ridiculous. And then with my last action, I'm going to sell mm -hmm. these two packages to Gloucester. Okay. With these two beers. The two beers. <laughs> but you flipped three tiles. That's great. That is great. Yeah. It works out really well. So I get five income for that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's just the victory points. Yeah. Four income for that. And one, one income for that. for that. Yeah. So the income at this point yeah. is really for tie breaking. Yep. And uh, that's it. And that's it. <clears throat> so we literally just score it the way we did last time. Yeah. So let's score rails and then victory points and see where we land. Okay. Okay. All right, let's score this bad boy this up. This thing is just a nasty mess. Mess of, of, of railroads. Cities. All right. All right, so All right. So start the same with... way we did last time. Yeah. yeah? Okay. Um, so this train, two, four, five, six. All right, so one, two, three, four, five, six. This one will be two, three, four, five. Okay. This one is two, three, four, five. Uh-huh. Five. Uh huh. And two, four, five. Uh huh. This one will be two, three, four. Okay. This one is two, three, four, five, six. Two, three, four, five, six. And one, two, three, four, five. For this one. Okay. See, 101. All right. Wow, I have a lot of points to make up so yes. far. Just so to far, get it. so far. You have a lot of trains out there, though. I do, but I don't know if they're all worth six. So, <laughs> one, two, three, four for this guy. One, two, three, four. One, two, three for this guy. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five for him. Three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five for him. One, two, three, four, five. 
One, two, three, four, five, six for him. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three for this guy. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two. And one, two, three, four, five for him. 85. All right. Okay. So I'm caught. I'm kept up. Yeah. Whew. All right. All right. So now, now we score our buildings. So let's look. 5, 10, 12, 17, mm -hmm. 20, 27, 32, 36, 41, 50. Oh, I see you added those together. Okay. <laughs> so I, can't, and, I can't do math. 151 for you. <laughs> 151? Yeah, I don't think I'm going to have. Wait, just all the way All around? the way to 51. Okay. I don't think I'm going to have 50 points in these. You Not might. even close. Mm. Yeah, I did a lot of building. 2, 4, 14, 19, 24, 29, 32, 37. 37. So that's 85 and 37 is 1... <laughs> 92 plus 30. Is what? Really? 122? <laughs> yeah, wow, you took I me I can't do like on the spot math. It's like a spelling bee. points! What? So you took me about like 30 points. Yeah. Yeah, that was big. I know. That was big. Well, I did a lot of big buildings, so. You did. At the end, you pulled out the big buildings, and my links yeah. just weren't cutting it. Well, and I focused on actually like kind of blocking you out over yeah here. you did like i made sure i had the routes and the interesting well i guess we yeah let's go talk about it. about it okay well there you have it brass birmingham 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 i wonder if they talked with the a southern twang back in 1870 i don't know because they kind of we were still colonies back then, so they yeah, sort so. of still had that British... Birmingham. Unless they got rid of it on purpose. Maybe. They were just like, we're going to have this new this way new, of speaking now. This new speak. <laughs> um, okay, so let's um, let's talk about this amazing game. Yes. That I love. <laughs> so we decided to come back on the light side, right? And we figured we'd pick the lightest game in our collection that we haven't played yet. <laughs> Clearly. <laughs> Uh, and get it to the table. I know. I may game? have I may have strategically unpacked this game first. <laughs> yes. Um, but anyway, let's um so let's let's talk about it because um, there's a lot of there's a lot of things I want to hit on. Sure. With regard to strategy and and some other stuff that was just really super unique about this game. Mm -hmm. um, but let's start as always with replayability. Yeah. yeah. Hi. <laughs> High replayability. Hi, indeed. Um, I mean, there's there's obviously some variability in setup, right? And that, that goes with these these tiles in the market. Right. They're not going to really sway things, but they will sort of guide you towards certain markets, I think. Right. And we didn't talk about that too much, I don't think, when we set the game up. But these right. merchant tiles, we drew randomly, like mm -hmm. blindly, to set out. Um, so you may end up, you know, if you're playing a two-player game, you have these two blanks yeah. of your five. You may end up with a city that's all blanks there's no merchants right you know what i mean um so it's just a matter of how they come out and what each city wants and it, it's weird because it just so happened that gloucester which is just south of birmingham wanted like all the commodities all the commodities so yeah. all the hotness kind of happened down here but yep. that could just as easily be you know any other city that you're playing with mm -hmm. which will really change the shape of the game yeah absolutely and i think the fact that you've you're you're dealt this hand of cards that is randomized right yeah. And that, that completely changes your approach because you may want to go after certain cities that you just don't have. Right. Uh, but that's, you kind of want cards to be able to burn, but you also want cards to be able to play or build specific, uh, you know, manufacturer uh, industry buildings, right? Right. And if you don't like, towards the end, I got kind of jammed yeah, up in my that. hand. I couldn't get the right buildings out. I could have wasted an action to try to get some wild cards in to, be, right. to have my stronger moves. But I don't know if that was enough to get me... 30 points right. to make up the difference, exactly. right? Exactly, yeah. Um, yeah, but from like from a replayability standpoint, the cool thing about this game, too, is that within the, the same game that you're playing, yeah. 
the way you play changes too. Yes. So in, um, you know, when you're in the first era, your canal era, you're really kind of spreading out and you saw us, like we kind of explored this like upper half of the map mm -hmm. a little bit more and you really are more, we were saying like off camera, we were talking about like you're disconnected, yeah. right? Like you're building these small little, maybe like villages or something. Yep. And it really encourages you to spread out where on the railroad side of the game, you're, you're really trying to focus in on these tight cities right? and make these like networks and stuff that are more or less kind of like closed off from other people, but you're still maximizing each other's routes. In a exactly. Way, which is kinda cool. But the, I think the, the trick is that the expansion becomes overly expensive. It so you have does. to really think about, you know, what you want to do as far as do you want to branch out or do you want to sort of build up your same city right and try to maximize scoring there well yeah i think it's about really balancing your income like generating enough income and knowing how much you can spend mm -hmm. because you know how much you're kind of going to be getting back yep next like round or whatever to kind of break even or maybe even make a little bit of money yeah um but yeah that will change depending on even like how many people you have playing and, and how big the board gets and, and all yeah. that kind of oh, thing. Yeah. So high, high replayability. I think so, yeah. In this one. Um, we'll start about weight. Yeah. As I said, this is probably one of the lightest games. No, <laughs> uh, it's, you know what, it's deceptively heavy. Um, I would say so. Yeah. I mean, I expected it to be heavy, but then reading the rules, I'm like, ah, this isn't a very it, exactly. thick rule book. It was yeah. pretty, pretty straightforward. Um, but once you are given like this board of industry and said okay go ahead and just start building you have to really kind of figure out the best combos and and we've not played this enough yet to mm -hmm. to learn those combos or what what strategy to go after do i develop early and take a lot of loans out to build to be able to build some of the more powerful buildings early or do i kind of just get stuff out on the board and try to maximize my income early to have right. money later like there's a lot of that and, and i think to just trying to piece all those moves together can get it can get pretty overwhelming because you have so much to do and then you've got a hand to manage. I'm like, I don't know what card to get rid of because right. I might need all of these. Yeah, I would say like from an audience standpoint, this is definitely not for, this is for an advanced gamer. Yeah. For right. sure. No because doubt. it is a little, I want to say almost like it's kind of sandboxy in a way yeah. because you can, from the very start of the game, you can literally go anywhere. Yeah. You can, that first move is going to catch some people up in you know, analysis process, it does me like every single time because mm -hmm. you're sitting there going, I want to plan the whole game out, but I have absolutely no idea what's going to come out, what I'm going to have to work with, or what's going to be the best strategy, but you're fixed. Yeah. Once you pick that location, you're, you know, sort of like kind of stuck there unless you can build in a different city, right. but then it's like you need coal to build in this thing. So it seems like you have a lot of options at first, but you really, you really are kind of limited at, in the very beginning, which yeah. you saw. Um, but yeah, this is definitely one I would say that, you know, if you like route building, but you want something a little more than mm -hmm. that, um, definitely, definitely. I think we'll talk about mechanics and some of the really unique things in a little bit, but, yep. um, but let's for now talk about theme and components mm. and quality with the caveat that this is the. Deluxe. deluxe version yeah so that's really all we can speak to <laughs> yeah, yeah so i mean this the the board the card stock the overlay like everything is is premium here i would say this is kind of like the player boards if you're familiar with like paper production mm -hmm. at all or like you know business card production this is like what you would consider like luxe yeah material like if you ever get like a luxe business card it's kind of this almost silky Feel it's and silky it just smooth. Feels good. Yeah, like you could. It's almost I like you could linen. spill a drink on this and it wouldn't even bother it. It would just like would just roll like off. Up. Yeah, and the <laughs> like cards vortex. are like linen stock. <laughs> yeah. um, now keep in mind the the chips we were using. Uh, these are the iron clays. This is an right. upgrade that we picked up at Gen Con. So these are definitely premium. But the game did. This is the deluxe version. So it did actually come with. Yeah. Iron clays, but not. You just got an extra denomination, didn't you? Yes, we? we got hundreds, which we didn't actually break out. Yeah. But this is sort of the expanded version of what came with the deluxe version mm -hmm. anyway. So um, it was, uh, you know, it's, it's definitely nice to have with yeah. the chips versus if we were to use cardboard just punch out money, which yeah. would have been like, eh. 
yeah, uh, the poker cool. chips are definitely the way to go. Um, so if you do happen to get the deluxe version, know that they will come with, they came with ours. So I'm assuming yeah. they come with all of the deluxe version. Um, I would say the art and stuff is beautiful. Yeah, it's a beautiful it's game. For as much as is going on in this game, um, and for as dark as it is, because it's kind of, I mean, it's a railroad game, so mm -hmm. it's got to be like a little bit, you know, like moody a little yeah. bit, but it's still, especially I prefer the day side. It's like kind of bright, yeah. but also you get that feeling like you're in this, uh, like even the borders, like yeah. this like iron frame. It's industrial. It's very cool. Yeah. So it all, really all works feel. well. Yeah. yeah. It's really, really cool. Yep. Really good. All right. Good. So theme and components, A plus. Um, I don't even want to go over fun factor because it's kind of like, I mean, I don't know if you didn't have time. <laughs> No, I mean, I if you like this type of game, you're going to have fun. I mean, that's yeah. just really what it comes down yeah. to. And I, we, we usually we do talk about fun factors of fun. If it wasn't fun, we wouldn't be yeah, playing exactly. it in front of you. So we may just mix that. that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> if it's not just, fun, you're probably going to see it. We'll let you decide if you think we have yeah, fun. Yeah, you tell it. us whether or not you thought it was fun. Yeah. Because, you know, we're going to, we, you know whether or not we had fun with the game just by watching us play it. So. Right. Um, so I don't know if you want to do like a compares to, because to me, this was not, this isn't really like our normal stock yeah. of game. Like we do a lot, we, we do, there's a lot of worker placements out there. Mm -hmm. And when we talk about heavy games, we play heavy games. It's typically like a work, a worker placement decision. Right. This was the first, like, not just railroad, but first like route building game mm -hmm. that I felt really challenged me. Yeah. So, I mean, if I think like compares to my other favorite route building game, it's probably like Whistle Stop. Maybe. Yeah, but that's like pure routes. routes. But, yeah, like. But this is so much more. I mean, the routes matter though. But right. But it's this, more this is than more just... like route building is part of it. Yeah. Building an economy. Yeah, that's really. And an good industry is here. really the the heart of this game. Yeah. So the, I, I think what what kind of throws you, at least through both uh -huh. of us at the beginning when we first laid this on the table, and, and I was showing you how to play. Right. Right. Um. The first thing you asked me was, all right, so I'm gener so I put my iron mine out and I'm gonna generate four resources right. and I'm like, No. Yeah. You're creating four resources for all of us to consume. Right. You're like, Why? I don't why do you get to use my yeah. stuff? I'm like, Well you kinda want me to use your stuff yeah. because it's gonna give you more income and then it starts to click a little bit. But I think you can't go into it thinking that, you know, these it's are true. my resources yeah. and I'm building these factories right. to produce stuff for me to improve Well, it's like mine. my beer. Like I'm sitting here with my beer, like yeah. I'm going to use these beers. But really, if you if you want to do that mm -hmm. with the few resources that you can grab, like the beer you can grab from any farm that you own, yeah. maybe. Maybe you want to keep that disconnected from other people so that they can't use it so you can take it. Yeah, if there's no route connected to anywhere. it, they can't take it, but exactly. you can. So there's strategy um, to it. The, yeah, so there's some strategy to do that. But as far as the stuff everybody's using, like the coal and the, and mm -hmm. the iron and stuff, I mean, it's, uh, I think the other, I was thinking like, um, I mean, much, 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 much lighter, mm -hmm. but like, I think Via Nebula is kind of like that. Isn't yeah, it's sort of that where feel you where... Like your, your communal resource This communal away, resource, yeah. Um, just because you found it doesn't yeah. mean that but it's, it's, it's just so yeah. it's so unique from what we've experienced yes right so this yeah. is kind of like it's not turned, natural it turned everything on its head for us yeah. which we love to see yeah because you know it, playing the same old same old uh, you know after a while gets a little bit tiresome yeah. so to see something that just really spins all of that around and says okay this is a different way to play right. and, and it's just like whoa okay that opens up a whole different approach to how we actually well, play I'd these. say the same thing for like the economy piece mm -hmm. because we're not typically drawn to like economy games right. necessarily i mean some do it really well but some it kind of like takes over the whole game yeah but this it made a lot of sense so it was like somebody uses your coal and you're not you know it's not like the end of the world because mm -hmm. it actually helps you because it develops your mind you know and even if you wanted to use it you can still you even saw at the very end of the game where you took my beer but I was still able to like make more beer and use it. Yeah. You know what I mean? Um, but with this market, it's a very like supply and demand driven um, like engine kind mm -hmm. of that you can manipulate a little bit or you want to be a little strategic about when you place your stuff out so that some of right. it does get sold to the market, uh, but not before you need to use it, you know? So it's a lot of little decisions that go into this game i mm -hmm. think that that you know definitely make it fun yeah for sure um and different than anything you know that we can probably compare it to yeah um expectations 
Uh, I think this is far exceeded what I expected. Yeah. I was expecting a euro in the normal worker placement, generate resources. and Me too, yeah. And that's not what this was. So I was just like, wow, okay, this is actually really, really cool. I didn't, you know, it took me a little while to, to, to really understand like well, all these cards. Well, I can just build here and do this. Like, right. What's the big deal? It doesn't matter what I throw out. But and then when you start playing it, it's like, okay, yeah, actually, these cards matter a lot more than I thought they right. did. Right, because you are quite limited. You are. You're, in you're what you so can very do. limited, and it's just um, it just keeps you on your toes constantly. Right. So I was not expecting um, this to be what it was, and I'm I'm very happy with 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 what it ended up being. Yeah, I'd say the same thing. I mean, I was excited about it um, just based on what I read and stuff. This is one of my like we have to pick this up mm -hmm. games um, and I'm glad we did but it did it, it exceeded my expectations completely because again I was thinking it was going to be more work like not not worker placement because I knew it was like route building but mm -hmm. I kind of I thought it was going to be lighter yeah um, especially after reading through the rules and all that kind of thing I was thinking it was going to be um, not as challenging kind of more just like fun to like move through and just like you'd know what to do intuitively yeah. and there's not that many games that i think we can pick up now that make us go oh wait a minute that mechanic does kind of challenge me a little bit right. you know or right. um you know so that was really really refreshing in yeah. this case um pros and cons oh well i think we've kind of gone over most of the pros right mm -hmm. with the components are gorgeous the game is really really cool like we yeah. really liked it um that art's beautiful yeah like, I, I mean I, I don't even have any cons for it because i think yeah. i mean it's a little long it is but yeah we are okay with long games so yeah. it's not that i wouldn't be a con for us maybe it's a con for somebody else who doesn't really want to sit and play right yeah that long of it a game. May, i would say your audience is probably gonna be limited on this yeah limited even audience. if you even if you play a lot of heavy games um it's also not soloable it's two to four. Ah, uh, yes. It's player count. So if you are somebody who, like, you're the only person who would probably sit and play this, then you probably need to, like, find us at PAX or something. Yeah. Up and <laughs> Ask us for a game because we'll sit and play um, this for sure. Yeah, we would definitely play this one, but not yep. everybody would, I don't think. So maybe just, like, accessibility. Yeah. Um, anything else that you wanted to say or mechanics you wanted to touch on? Uh, no, I think um, I think we pretty much... Okay. Covered most, if not all, of what we wanted to talk about, right? I'm just really impressed with the strategy in this one. Yeah. I was. And I think that I really kind of feel like, just kind of like thinking about the game we just played, mm -hmm. I took a chance this time and like started spending my money on those double routes right. earlier. Yeah. And I think that it was worth it. I think it paid off. Yeah. Because I really tried to like, sequester this whole area off <laughs> right with at a time when i knew i was making like 12 15 bucks around right. anyway so it was kind of it was almost like free to do if mm -hmm. i didn't have anything else right like, while you had enough beer time. out to support while i had enough beer out to building support the routes, it. Exactly. yeah that made sense yeah i think that was a good thing but but yeah this one like really intrigues me to like keep playing mm -hmm. to try to figure out like what to the find best, out more stuff because best strategies. yeah it's, it's a lot of fun yep so all right, well, there you have it, Brass Birmingham. Hope you enjoyed the playthrough, and uh, we'll see you next time. See ya.